This is the Order Obsidian 3D printer. And I won't give my thoughts in this quick video. This printer has uh, auto leveling sensor, filament sensor, power failure sensor, and what I really like, power off sensor when you print will be finished. This printer came with uh, two Z axis. Yeah, super nice uh, and clean desinch. Like you see, all these cables. Really nice and clean desinch. I really love this spool holder. Nice place. I don't like when spool holder uh, on the top of the printer. I think uh, if you have spool holder on the top of the printer yeah can be not stable or something if you compare to Ender 3 V2 printer some people asking me to compare those two printers I definitely going to choose this one all sensors direct dual drive extruder it works outstanding. I getting super cool print quality. I'm using simplified 3D flyzer. I playing with this printer some uh, two three days. I might getting really really nice prints. I printed uh, bracket for my camera. I printed. Uh, Mandalorian model that I created. You can find uh, uh, link below, and you can try to print by yourself this model. Really cool model, actually. This printer you have some 3D printing parts like filament sensor holding parts, auto leveling holder, and uh, duct. Filament cooling duct. I really don't like this cheap PLA. Like you see, it's already break it for me. But they provided all files for free. You can get in your, you can found in your SD card when you receive this printer. So it's no big deal. You can print your own parts. I'm using uh, silk PLA. It's much more better for me works much more better, it's more, more flexible and it's not breaks so easily like simple cheap PLA I think they're using some cheap PLA or something they, of course PLA are very fragile so it's yeah it's just question of the time so I'm very recommend that you print all these parts by using PTG or silk PLA when you remove prints from you heated bed, wait until your bed becomes cold. That's like you see now. When it's cold, you can super easy to remove your prints. When it's hot, can be a little bit difficult to remove. I really love this, but I think this is PTG or something plastic. So remember guys, you remove your printed parts and bet it's cold. Check this out. I really love printing quality. I pre-made my own uh, firmware. You can find and download for free in this video description. I'm testing and getting super real and nice print quality that's my quick review of this uh, 3d printer if you wish to have printer that have auto leveling filament runout sensor power failure sensor pause print 
and power off sensor. I think this is great, great printer to have. You can buy this printer from uh, Gearbest. I think only Gearbest selling this printer, and it costs less than 300 euros. I think 290 euros or something. Enjoy, subscribe, and uh, more videos coming soon.